Hello, welcome to Sage Tales channel. Before you start watching this video, I recommend subscribing to my channel Sage Tales. Subscribe and like. In a quaint town nestled among abundant woodlands, resided an aged gentleman by the name of Samuel Thompson. Fondly referred to as Grandpa Samuel, his life had been intertwined with nature since birth, and his heart beat in harmony with the woods. Renowned for his sagacity, empathy, and the spark of wonder that danced in his eyes whenever he recounted tales, he was a beloved figure among the townsfolk. On a radiant morning, as Grandpa Samuel embarked on his customary stroll through the woods, a poignant scene unfolded before him. Concealed beneath a tangle of foliage, a small wolf cub, vulnerable and helpless, came into view. Its once pristine fur was now tangled and soiled, and its eyes mirrored a mixture of trepidation and solitude. The undeniable truth was evident. The cub had been forsaken by its pack. Empathy enveloped Grandpa Samuel's heart, causing it to swell as he lowered himself to the ground beside the quivering creature. His voice, a gentle whisper, reached the cub's ears. Oh, my precious little soul, what trials have befallen you? With utmost tenderness, he scooped the cub into his worn hands, craddling it against his chest, seeking to provide comfort and solace. It's okay, little wolf cub. You're safe now, Grandpa Samuel assured, his voice filled with tenderness. He knew he couldn't leave the cub alone to face the perils of the forest. Determined to protect and care for it, he decided to bring the cub home. Back at his cozy cabin, Grandpa Samuel carefully set the cub down and observed its fragile state. He named it Luna, after the moon that had illuminated their chance encounter. Luna's eyes glimmered with a mix of curiosity and vulnerability as she cautiously explored her new surroundings. Days turned into weeks and weeks into months. Grandpa Samuel and Luna formed an unbreakable bond. Luna's playful nature brought a youthful energy to the aging man's life, while Grandpa Samuel's wisdom guided the young cub's journey through the woods. Together, they embarked on countless adventures, their laughter echoing through the trees. As time went on, Luna grew stronger and wiser. Her once timid demeanor transformed into that of a confident and majestic wolf. But her gratitude towards Grandpa Samuel never wavered. She showered him with affection, nuzzling against his side and providing comfort during moments of solitude. One winter, a devastating storm swept through the region, leaving a trail of destruction in its wake. The forest was in shambles, and many animals were injured and displaced. Grandpa Samuel, now frail and unable to provide the help needed, worried about the suffering around him. Grandpa Samuel's heart ached as he witnessed the aftermath of the storm. He knew that the injured and displaced animals needed assistance, but his old age limited his ability to provide direct help. However, his love for the forest and its creatures inspired him to find a way to make a difference. With a glimmer of determination in his eyes, Grandpa Samuel reached out to the local community. He rallied the townsfolk, organizing a volunteer group dedicated to the recovery and rehabilitation of the forest and its inhabitants. The group consisted of passionate individuals from all walks of life who shared a deep reverence for nature. Together, they cleared fallen trees and debris, ensuring safe pathways for the injured animals to navigate. They set up makeshift shelters and feeding stations, providing a refuge for those without homes. The community donated food, supplies, and medical assistance, coming together to support the healing process. While Grandpa Samuel coordinated efforts from the sidelines, Luna, now a strong and capable wolf, played an essential role. She utilized her keen senses to locate injured animals in need of aid. Luna would gently nudge Grandpa Samuel, guiding him to the wounded creatures hidden in the nooks and crannies of the forest. With a calm demeanor, Luna reassured the injured animals, her presence bringing them solace and trust. Grandpa Samuel, aided by the volunteers, provided the necessary medical care, nursing them back to health. As the days passed, 
the forest started to recover and the injured animals regained their strength. Grandpa Samuel's heart swelled with pride as he witnessed the remarkable transformation brought about by their collective efforts. The once devastated forest now flourished with renewed life and the grateful animals found their way back to their natural habitats. The community's involvement didn't end there. Inspired by the impact they had made, they formed a long-term initiative to protect the forest and its inhabitants. Regular cleanup drives were organized to maintain the forest's pristine condition, and awareness campaigns were conducted to educate others about the importance of environmental conservation. The initiative went beyond the city. Grandpa Samuel and his comrades reached out to neighboring communities, spreading their message of unity and respect for the environment. Their efforts attracted local media attention, reinforcing their message and inspiring others to join them. Government officials took notice of the remarkable work done by Grandpa Samuel and the community. Recognizing the importance of preserving the region's natural resources, they provided additional funding to support ongoing conservation efforts. The town has become a shining example of what a united community, driven by a common goal, can accomplish. If you like this story, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, subscribe and like.